get started. Music? Yep, cool. All right. Nice big juicy arm circles. Get those arms warmed up. You can do swimmers if you want. And then let's go backwards. And then crisscross. And then bring one arm over. Nice big stretch here. Okay, set. Go ahead and roll down. Forward fold. Nice big stretch of those hamstrings. Go ahead and come to one side. And then the other. And then let's do a high knee twist here. Give it to me, I'm worth it. Baby, I'm worth it. Couple more here. And then we're gonna go into a booty kick here. Keep those heels up nice and high. You can take it into a jog if you want. Couple more here. And then we're gonna come into a deep lunge. Bring that right leg back. Drop it down to the floor. Walk that left leg out to the outside edge of your mat. And then come into a nice deep forward fold here. Inhale, push back. Exhale, stretch out that left hamstring. And then go ahead and switch legs, bring that right leg forward. Again, on the outside edge of your mat, bring your hands on the inside of your right foot. And then when you're ready, go ahead and push back into that hamstring stretch. And then go ahead and come back up to standing. We're gonna take it back into that high knee march. Bring our arms 10. 10 seconds here. All right, and let's go ahead and drop down into a body weight squat here. Come down and hold. Add a little pulse here. Go ahead and stand up, shake that off. Grab your weights if you have them, or a heavy household item. We're gonna hold them in the middle of our chest. Feet are gonna turn up just slightly, and we're gonna drop it into a weighted squat here. Head and chest up. Nice and slow. Squeeze your glutes together and push through your heels as you come up. Couple more here. Last two. And we're going into jumping jacks. Go ahead and top those weights. Jumping jacks for 20 seconds. Take it low impact if you need. Good, keep going. We got five more seconds here. All right, go ahead and grab those weights again. We're going back into that goblet squat. Weights to your chest. Drop it. You can turn the feet out a little wider this time. Put that head and chest up. Let's go, girls. 
Two more here. Drop it and hold. Little pulses here. For five, three, two, and one. Set your weights down. We're going back into that jumping jack. And go. Five more seconds. Three, two, and one. Last set of squats. Grab those weights. Bring your feet back to narrow this time. Back and down. Keep pushing. Last five. Last two. And drop it back to those jumping jacks. Last 20 seconds here. And we got five, three, two, and one. Go ahead and grab a sip of water if you need it. Towel off. We're going to go into a bent row. So grab those weights. You're going to hinge at the hips, slight bend in your knees. Weights come down. Pull to your chest. Elbows stay in line with your body. Keep that chin away from your chest. Core is just gently pulled up and in. Couple more here. Last three. Two. And one. Drop your weights. We're going to go into a plank with a shoulder tap. So here, tap your shoulders. Try not to twist your hips too much. You can drop to your knees if you need to. Or elevate like I am. Keep pushing. Ten more seconds here. Last five. Two. And one. Come back up to standing. Grab those weights. We're going right back to that bent row. Man, I feel like a woman. If you have heavier weights or it gets to be too much, switch to an alternating row. Sit away from your chest. Good. You can also use a resistance band for this if you have one. If you don't have weight, anchor it under your feet. We got five. Last two. And last one. Back to that plank with the shoulder tap. Again, keep those hips from rolling around. Keep pushing. 10 more seconds. Keep going, keep going. Looking good, Mary. Good job, D. Last three, two, and one. All right, back to those rows. Last set, make them count. Two more here. And then we go back to those shoulder taps. Last time. It's time 
Make sure you have a nice flat back and hips are pushing forward, especially if you're on your knees. We don't want to be back here. Forward. Keep pushing. 10 more seconds. Last five here. Three, two, and one. Come back, shake those arms out. Grab some water if you need it. Grab those weights. You may want to drop to a lighter weight than what you had for the rows. We're going to start with our palms facing our chest. We're going to open and then push overhead. Coming back down, rotating back in. Weights come to touch at the top. Keep those shoulders curled down away from your ears. Good. Slight bend in your knees. Gently pull your core up and in as you tuck your hips under to keep a neutral spine. Last five here. And last one. Go ahead and set those weights down. We're gonna go into a shadow box here. Nice and fast. Light on your feet. We got 10 more seconds here. Keep punching. Like you mean it. We got five, three, two, and one. Back to that Arnold class. Hold the space, rotate, overhead. Ooh. Keep pushing. If you need to lower weight, go ahead. Last three here, two, and one. We're gonna go side to side punches. Bonus, if you keep your weights in your hands, really twist that spine. Sometimes I go too far. Keep pushing. Looking good, D, looking good, Mary. Last five, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Shrug those shoulders up. Roll them back and down. Always in your ears a few times. Last set of presses here. Set the weights down if you need a little break. You can also switch to one arm if you need to. Last five here. Three. Last one. Hold on to those weights if you want. We're going into little tight uppercuts. So just a little twist and throw from the hip. Keep pushing. Ten. Nine. Eight. Six. Five, three, two, and one. All right, we're gonna go into a reverse lunge with a forward raise. So alternating right leg, left leg back. Lifting one arm, or lifting both arms, I mean. Keep that core tight. Make sure you're dropping that back knee into a lunge. Good, keep going. Looking good, Mary. Good job, D. Last five here. Three, two, and one. Go ahead and set your weights down. We're gonna go into high knees, either marching 
or I need to Take Stick what you need. Let me go for 20. Keep pushing. Last 10 here. Pick it up, last five. Three, two, and one. Back to those reverse lunges with the forward raise. Drop the weights if you need to. Make sure you're lowering that back knee down to the ground. Keep pushing. Couple more here. Last three, two, and one. Shake that off. We're gonna go back to those high knees. So either march here or take it up into a jog. You can also jog in place if you can't get the knees up that high. Just keep moving. We have five more seconds here. Let's do it a little harder. Three, two, and one. Last set of lunges with a forward raise. Keep pushing. Keep going. Two more here. Drop the weights, shake it out. Last tiny march. And a little twist if you want. Or keep taking it into that high knee jog. A nice 30 second rest period after this. So keep pushing. All right, let's pick it up. Last 10 seconds. Jog in place. Pick up the march. Last five, three, two, and one. Shake it off, grab some water. We have 30 seconds here, and then we're gonna come down to the floor. Mm. Not yet, sorry, we got one more before we hit the floor. How are we feeling? Good? All right. You're gonna need one of your weights. We're gonna go into a tricep kickback with a single leg kick. So, left hand on your hip, all your weight on your left leg. Right arm comes up to the side. You're gonna kick back and lift your right leg back. If that's too much, you can just drop it here and just do the kickback. And we're gonna go in five. Three, two, and one. You can also hold onto a wall if you need. Good, really keep that core engaged. Nice gentle squeeze here. Last five. Three, two, and one. Switch sides. Nice and controlled here. Whew. Last two and one. Take that off. We're going right back to the other side. No cardio this time. You're welcome. Yeah. Know how to satisfy. 
Two more here. Keep that hip rolled down to the floor. Don't let it open to the ceiling. Switch sides. Two more here. Take it off. Last set, switch sides. Two more here and then we switch. Other side. Almost there. Two more. And two. Grab your other weight. Hinge the hips. Try to kick back. Burn out for 30 seconds. Slow and controlled, no swinging. Chin away from your chest, neutral spine. Drop if you need to. Keep pushing. We've got 10, five, three, two, last one, stand up straight, hold it back. Palms face the sky, a little pulse here. For 10, eight, five, three, two, and one. All right, drop that, grab some water. We're really coming to the floor now. We're gonna be on our back, bridge position, with your weights. Weights are in line with your chest. You're gonna lift up in the bridge and chest press here. Keep the hips lifted as you go up and down. If it's too much to hold, you're gonna lower and raise. But try to step as long as you can. Keep going. Eight. Six. Three, two, and one. Lower down. Cross one leg over. Lift up. Single leg bridge with the fly. Open those elbows out. Keep going. Two more here, and then we switch legs. Lower down. Switch, lift that other hip up. Last four here. Three, lift those hips a little higher. Two, and one. Lower down, we by your side. Heel tap. Keep that chin away from your chest. Look up at the ceiling. We got 10, eight, four, two, and you're done. Go back, stretch those arms overhead. Deep breath in and out. Grab your weights again. We're gonna lift up into that bridge. Press, press. Keep those hips lifted, you can do this. Keep going. Last six. Three, two, and one. Lower down. Sometimes a little break. And we go back to that fly. 
can either go into a bridge or leave the hips on the ground. Quite bending those elbows. Last six. Three. Two. And one. Reach down by your side. Last set of heel taps. Let me go for 10. Five, three, two, and one. Lower down. Relax everything. Stretch it out. Grab your weight. Overhead. You're going to pull the weight forward as you lift your hips up. And then lower down as you go back. Couple more here. Last one. All right, go ahead and rock up. And go into a half step here. Roll back. If you want to make this harder, you can go into a knee tap. Or you can stay right here with a tiny little roll back. For five, three, two, and one. Go ahead and shake that off. Put your waist away, you're done with them. If you're doing the November challenge, grab your notebook. We're going into our AMRAP finisher. Whoo, who's ready for that? I know I'm not, but we're gonna do it anyway. All right, guys. We're gonna do burpees first, because burpees, right? All right, let's. Ooh, let's go. All right, one minute, and, oh my God, go. Okay, go. Modify as needed. Keep pushing, mama, sir. Mama, sir, keep going, keep going, keep going. Last 10. Okay, great, Mary. Good job, G. Keep it up. Five, three, two, and one. Go ahead and take a moment. Write down your reps. And we're gonna go for another round. Sorry, we have mountain climbers next. My bad. All right, mountain climbers in five, three, two, and go. Keep pushing. You're gonna survive, keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Almost there. We got six, five, three, two, and one. Whew. All right, we got one more thing left, but it is eight o'clock, so if you have to go, no worries. 
Um, we're gonna do squat jumps for one minute if you wanna stick around. And let's go in five, three, two, and one. Squat with the calf raise is totally okay too. Keep pushing. Almost there, keep pushing. Good deep, good deep, good job, Mary. You got eight, six, five, three, two, and one. Ooh. Hey, you guys crushed it. Definitely stretch. Don't forget to sign up for your classes next week. How are you feeling? The AMRAP is rough, huh? <laughs> All right, quick selfie ladies, thanks for joining me. Have a great weekend.